never even seen Ghost play. No idea who he is. Red Rocks? Okay. Oh, maybe I did see him play at the, the one tournament they had there. Right there? Cool. Ghost from Red Rocks going to be taking on our very own Platt. Uh, Platt plays Fox, Toon Link. Uh, he's a I didn't know about the Tink. I knew that he was a Lucina before he went to the Fox. Yeah, and he has like a Palutena or something too. Oh, really? Uh, okay. Yeah, a lot, of, a lot of weird side pocket characters. But I'm pretty sure he'll stick with Fox. I'm almost certain. He usually only picks the others when he's desperate. So. Ah. <laughs> Looks like Platt's ready to go and Ghost coming on down, hopefully. So they are sitting on the wrong side of each other. Oh, I know Ghost. Yeah, he hosts a oh. lot of Red Rock turns. Yeah, I, didn't, I just didn't know that was his pet. Yeah, it's Forest. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Coolio. Yeah, at at the a, one tournament he's hosted so far, audience. he made pretty cool uh, trophies uh, for the winners of those. And he said that he's going to be doing that again for the next tournament he hosts. So trophies for first place in both teams and singles at... Uh, what's it called? Red Rocks Semester End something. Some kind of smash event at Red Rocks. You should all go. Alright. Enough selling Red Rock Smash, smash 4, 4 nice. to you people. <laughs> You're already watching. Let's see what we got here. Setting up some... I didn't I didn't really get to look at his button layout. Um, tilts on C-Stick, I'm pretty sure. And then... Tap jump or no? No tap jump. Good. Both of them got those stone cold killer faces. So saying just enough words, no more than necessary. I like it. Forrest got his game. Oh no, he started smiling. God. Am I wrong in saying that? And these he guys leaned over and oh my goodness. I thought that these guys were good friends, so I'm surprised to see them playing round one. Forrest went whatever. anime girl for like 30 seconds there. Exactly. Hands on the cheeks, smiling, big as could be. I don't like that. <laughs> this is game time, Forrest. <laughs> Get it together. Oh, boy. There you go. Dead in the eyes. Pretend you have answers. This matchup Let's go. is... I, I love playing this matchup with Fox, dude. Ganon just doesn't get to touch you, ever. Oh, my God. Why is he playing Ganon? He plays Ganon. Because his tag used to be get kicked. And Ganon up smash. Kick. Kick over and over. That's and cool over. and all. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> you shouldn't be playing again. I yeah, agree. Uh, you can play uh, Ganon. You also shouldn't be ending up on FD as your starter. Like, I don't know what Ganon's banning to end up here, but you banned wrong. Yeah, you need those platforms to land, buddy. But we'll see what he's doing. He's, he's got some nice little lagless pressure going on here. Oh, tech chases. Oh. Calls in place twice. Um, not many people are going to do in place twice. Yeah, especially after getting punished the first time. Fox coming out of the gate, bringing back the combos, but missed jab there. Oh my gosh. Almost landed into yeah. death. Brave Fox going in with a, a dare. You don't usually want to challenge Ganon up smash. It's just really good. It's the one move that he has that you can actually say is really good. Mm. I actually like his dash attack too. Sets okay. up for a lot of heavy aerials, like really just neutral air and up air. Again. Uh, even on the power shield, Fox wasn't able to get in there on time on that smash. Again, just showing how good that move is. He's Ooh. also not getting follow-ups that are pretty guaranteed. Dash attack up air. That should just be his thing all day. Yeah, that should be bread and butter. Fox is... Again, missing the dash attack up air. And I feel like he's going for too much up air instead of trying to just get him off stage. And just keep the pressure on. That was That's really it. good. After the up smash on shield, uh, Ooh, Ghost went for right just an F tilt. And Fox F smash through it, but now he's just gonna die. Cannon hits pretty hard. All right, so he doesn't have a jump here. Ah, uh, okay, good wait. I wanted to see an up smash though. He could have charged it and had that air dodge. Uh, that wasn't necessary. He just yeah. saved Cannon's life. Cannon was absolutely dead. He was trying to style with the air there. Oh, that would have a shield broke. Okay, take was, it. Bad DI. Was, yeah, that was poor DI. We get, I want to see more up smashes. That's definitely the the smash. Oh, Ooh. is that it? That's I don't a turn around. Yeah, that's it. He's gone. Mm. Oh my god. KO'd at 14%. Reverse Ganon or Warlock Punch, whatever it's. Oh my goodness. Brutal. Yeah, Shield Lessel against Ganon. 
Um, Ghost showing us why he plays you, Ganon. I don't you, know. you don't really need to like <laughs> run into his range where he's gonna hit your shield. He should always just yeah. exist out of it. And when he finally throws a exactly. laggy down tilt, just get in there. You you always want to stay just outside of Ganon's pressure range and then punish any reaction that you bait him into. So usually running in and shielding will bait him into side being. You just short hop right up and then punish him with a landing area. You know, there's a lot of different ways to do it. That's just an example. Reverse hitbox of neutral. There's an interesting option. I'm really curious to see what Platt is going to use for his kill options here. So yeah, whooping out that Palatina. I said he had a pocket Palatina. He didn't believe me. I, I didn't. I didn't know that was a thing. Uh, punishes Warlock <laughs> Punch with Neutral B. Interesting. <laughs> and, oh, just wrong read with the Warlock Punch. Or the, I don't even know what it's called. Warlock Rap. Choke Slam. Rock Bottom. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> uh, up B, or up tilt and neutral. Not not the best option. Ganon should never be up tilting. Yeah. Like, it just doesn't exist in Ganon's kit. Never up tilt. Uh, to be honest, both of these players have made a lot of poor decisions in the neutral. Like, <laughs> right here, they're... Most professional players, you'll see, like, just try to safely space each other till they land a combo move, and then take that advantage as far as they can. Where these Smash players just seem they're trying to hit anything they can, regardless of it being laggy or space ball. Oh, and despite the 50% lead that Platt has, he's going to get grabbed by side B. True. Except I have noticed Ghost does like to land with his lagless neutral air, and Platt hasn't figured out a decent way to punish that. Uh, auto radical sucks. We saw it right there. Yeah. <laughs> One of the worst projectiles. Yep, baiting out that choke slam. Now we're starting to see a lot of rolls. Let's see if anyone catches on to these rolls. And I love Palatina's uh, jab to grab. Like it yeah, has such a good really range. Good. So good use of the invincible shield. Good little chain. Platt taking this, running away with it. Yeah, if he gets another grab, I'd really like to see down throw bar bear. Yeah, I think uh, Ghost is trying to bait him into the choke really slam good. again. So. Rubber. And yeah, if you'll notice that uh, Ghost's entire game plan is just throw out a lagless move and hope that uh, Platt rushes in recklessly afterwards. And, <laughs> and then Platt has just fallen for it so many times in a row. It's, yeah, I don't, it's, it's going to be like up him. smash to F tilt. Yeah, or almost every time. Landing or nair to jab. Uh, yeah, like it's, it's been very repetitive and predictable yet. Oh. I guess Platt has kind of gotten hit less, but Ganon's so slow I don't feel like he should be getting hit by it. Anything at all, if you know that was coming. really scary, challenging the Ganon down air with up air. Could have been the set. Actually, Ghost ended up taking game one. Yeah, but confidence is key. Whenever. Oh. I mean, I don't really like Ganon's edge game. He can't really... Those were hard. super hard. I like that smash. beefy up B. Good work on Ghost there, dropping the ledge. That should be oh. it, yep. Yep, good up smash. All right, so Platt taking game two with Palatina. Uh, I'm very interested on what Ghost is banning. Lilat, maybe? Uh, yeah, I feel like he might mess up the teleportation to a ledge that's moving. Um, no, no, not Platt. Ghost. Because Platt... Oh, I see. Yeah, again, might be. Might be. Which, Ganon needs platforms. Like, without them, he can't land very well. Neutral air can only work for so long. Until someone figures out how to punish a neutral air. Battlefield? Town? What are they doing? They're talking. I want to see Dreamland. They're talking to Zranzax. Lilac Cruz. That's an interesting choice. I feel like people always pick here just to cheese, try to cheese their opponent. Yeah, I'm really surprised to see a Ganondorf picking here. I guess. I mean, his up smash hits through the platforms here, so that's pretty cool. Ganon has pretty good magnet hands too. So. True. True. So we'll see where it takes him. Landing both those hits in there. That took about half her shield. That was ridiculous. But a quick 26% with Palatina coming right out of the gate. Okay, I'm liking the pressure. Oh, yeah, he just oh. needs to not get side bead like, like he did at a really, really percent last game. Uh, and this Palatina is just clean neutral should be able to carry this, you know. Ganon's really slow. Platt really maximizing on those punishes here. I like it. Yeah, and... I'm just now still questioning why a Ganondorf would pick the Lilat. It's just strange to me. It's better than FD. I don't know. <laughs> That's yeah, but what was, what was the ban? Even even like Town is better. Battlefield is no, better. No, I agree. I agree. I personally hate this stage. Anyway, so. He's probably looking for that choke slam. Flat not giving it to him. Uh, not the best recovery. This might be it. Magnet hands, nope. we got you. 
telling you, those things are... Goes for the up air. That actually would have taken the stock, I'm pretty sure. Notice me, senpai. We notice you. I'm not Dan, but I notice you. Silly monkey. Yeah, right. that's going to take the stock. Down throw, up air. It looks like Ghost is DIing in on all of the down throws. Yeah, he's falling for every up air. So. Um, that is not a true combo up to the 130% that he was at there. Yeah. DI out, and he would have been fine. It actually turns into a mix-up of back yeah. air. Yeah, that's so. the raw bear. But we also yeah. haven't seen the raw bear for a <laughs> Yeah, we don't need to So you might as well like, make him play yeah. into it. Well, no, we haven't seen him do it. It's probably the best. Oh, that's a downer. Is he gonna get a fair? Oh, he's gonna go for another and miss it. Oh. There's the fair on the tech chase. I would like to see the up smash. I mean, after oh, the, oh my god, my and god. the shield break. His warlock punch. Yeah, why wouldn't you? Oh my god, you're terrible. Oh, oh and my so god. He's gonna, and it's still gonna take the stock. Mixing up the di on Plaid. Uh, not, not understand. I don't even understand what that was. Okay, so reset. Ganon at fifty-eight percent. Let's. This set's been ridiculous. Yeah, the whole venue still actually popped off about that one. <laughs> They're still laughing about That's it. That's two shield breaks in his set. That's with Ganon. I mean. <laughs> oh. Um. Okay. Yeah. Well, throws that one away. GG's. The JV Harry. two star. So yeah, he kind of got tilted at the end there. Kind of downbeat off the side and.